What was the, fight, what was the game winning touchdown drive? I mean, I'm, I'm watching on the sideline, just taking it slow, taking it, don't try to jump to conclusions, don't don't doubt your teammates, and I just, I mean, for our whole sideline, we really just took it one play at a time, make make a good play, get back into it, make another play, get back into it, and I think that's how our offense played on that last drive, too. No matter what they did before the game, they were able to finish on the at the end of the game. You guys were able to score quick a lot. Was there a seed of doubt, at least a little bit in your mind when that drive started, given how long you had to go and how little time there was? Um, I mean, personally, I had, I'm not going to say I had doubt, but I could have confidence in my teammates, but at the same time, I mean, we played a team that they were making plays. So, I mean, we were able to make plays, they were able to make plays, and I thought at the end, came down to it, who's going to make the last play, and we were able to. When and how are you planning on making um, I don't know. Um, I'll probably figure something out in the next month. So, I mean, I can't say. I, I honestly don't know. So, we'll see. Maybe this month. Maybe in the next couple of days. I don't. I'm not sure, honestly. I mean, that's why I felt like this game. I had to come out and play it my heart, my hardest. I I don't know what's gonna happen in the future, but I know what I can do this game. So, I was, I wanted to leave the seniors off, especially with um, great experience. And by doing that, I just had to play my hardest, my hardest game I could play. That This game really showed a different side of our team. We're able to come back, fight through adversity, and come back and win the game. I mean, we were down, but nobody was out, and we were able to really come through as a team when we needed it. You think that does a lot for your, the whole time to look around? Yeah, de what definitely. Year, I mean, it really opens up a lot of people's eyes. I mean. It's different when you're when you have the lead. You can be a lot more calm. You can be a lot more passive. You can be, I mean, you can give them more space. But I mean, when it's a close game, you have to be on your A game every single play. Be focused, and I thought we were able to do that at the end. Thanks. Did you guys need a game like this? Did you guys need a game like this almost to kind of bring you guys together and and just that emotional game instead of a you know game you win by 28 points? I mean, I thought. From the start, our coaches were telling us that we're going to be in a dogfight. I mean, Oregon State isn't that type of program that's going to come off a loss and not be ready to play the next week. So, I mean, we, we knew from the start that it was going to be a dogfight and we were going to have to play all four quarters and be ready to go. I mean, this game really brought out the best in our team for the fact that we were able to fight through adversity, like I said, and I think that's the biggest thing. What did the uh, helper say to you guys after you guys have been addressed yet? Um, yeah, I mean, it was kind of fast. He just said, I mean, great job of the team. We made it a lot harder than we, we could have been. But at the same time, they played great. They, they knew what they were going to do, and they had a plan, and we had a plan. So, I mean, at the end of the day, Coach Helfer said, it matters what the ending score is. Not matter. It doesn't matter how much you win by. How strange was it to, to win a game like that? Have you ever played a game like that in high school or anything? I mean, I've definitely I played in a lot of close games, but I have to say that was probably the most memorable game of my life. You guys always talk about how close knit you guys are as teammates. How big was Josh off and, and inspiring to see and, and how he played in the fourth quarter? I mean, he's great. He's, I mean, he's a great player. I know we know what he's capable of doing, and you just got to go out there and do it. I mean, it's time for talking and there's time for doing and. Obviously, in the fourth quarter, you got to do it.